welcome back to the Law Firm Logo Help video. Uh, in this video, we'll see how to edit text and colors in Adobe Photoshop. So let's open the PSD folder here and uh, then choose whether you need print or screen file. In order to open the file, you can either double click on the icon or if you have uh, the Photoshop already open, just simply drag it directly into your workspace. For the purposes of this tutorial, we will use a print version of the file. Uh, here you can see uh, different color versions of the logo and if you want to see them, you can do it just uh, simply by turning layer groups on and off. And uh, let's work on the color version. Uh, let's open up the group. The way to open up the group is just simply select this little triangle icon here and we'll open up the group. So we have the background, the text and these two shapes. Okay, why don't we begin with the color. To edit the colors you can either double click on the shape or the layer or uh, you can use foreground and uh, background colors from the tools panel to um, set your colors uh, for easier editing. Uh, to set the foreground color, double click on the set the foreground color in the tools panel and set your own color. Let's say we want to make this 100% magenta. Okay, and we can set the background color. Let's say we want to make something green. Okay, now we have the colors set. Uh, let's select the layer we want to recolor. Let's say this shape main shape. This is the main shape. Um, to color it with the foreground color that we have set here, we need to press Alt Backspace. For recoloring in the background, uh, select use the shortcut uh, Control Backspace. Now again, Alt Backspace, it will color with the foreground color. Control Backspace, it will color with uh, the background color. Uh, this would be the easier way to recolor your entire design. Instead of double clicking, then go to color, change it, etc. etc. This is the fastest way to do this in Adobe Photoshop. Uh, unfortunately, it's not as fast as Illustrator or InDesign. Okay, now that we have our color set, Let's move to the text. First, uh, let's make sure that we have the uh, character panel open. If you don't see character panel, go to window, character, or simply use the shortcut control T to open and close the panel. Oops, sorry. Uh, oh yeah, this Photoshop doesn't have the shortcut. Uh, never mind forget what I said about Control T. Uh, once we have uh, our character panel open, let's double click on the text we want to change. You can either double click on the layer or you can select the uh, tool, text type from the tools panel and select all the text and just type in your own text and you're done. Um, if you want to edit the text further, uh, you can use character panel to do it. Here you can change the font family, you can change the font style, size, uh, leading, kerning, etc. Uh, you can change whether your fonts, uh, whether all caps, bold, italic, etc. etc. Okay, so uh, that was it for this video. Thank you for watching this help video and remember, if you have any questions about the template or you need any additional help, please feel free to contact me on help at 
www.mdesign.com. Uh, you will see uh, the email address here. Um, that was it. Thank you for watching and see you in the next tutorial. Bye.